In this video, we're going to take a look at Fort Stevens Park and the wreck of the Peter Iredale in Northwest Oregon right after this. Fort Stevens uh, State Park is located near Warrington and uh, pretty close to Astoria, Oregon. We were up there doing some filming to find accessible things to do there. And so Cheryl's coming off of our uh, transportation, our accessible van that was provided. And uh, she's on her Will CI2. Where she's going to explore the areas uh, where there's park and take a look at this as the big parking lot. And then we're going to go down to the beach. And uh, you want to stay and see that because we'll be down on the beach right near the, the wreck of the Peter Iredale. It was interesting that uh, in the near the parking lot they had uh, some accessible uh, porta potties. There's not any uh, running water here at the park. It's just uh, porta potties. But they did have one that was wheelchair accessible. And she's headed down now to pick up a trail. This trail uh, that she's going to join right ahead of us here will actually uh, go to a lake. We're not going to go that far down, but she's going to go down the trail a little bit. And there's our photographer, one of the ones we were working with. He's kind of following along. He's going to shoot videos. The rest of us were over exploring the sand dunes and the beach area. And we're going to go there in just a minute. But uh, I'll let you listen and watch as Cheryl goes down that way. I would ask that um, if you have been to uh, this area of uh, northeast Oregon, excuse me, northwest Oregon, do me a favor. Put it down in the comments. Let me know if you've been to Astoria and, and seen the wreck of the Peter Iredale. I appreciate it. Go ahead and put your... Comment down in the in the comments. This trail is really accessible. It's a nice and a little bit of a downhill to it, but not much. It goes down to a lake. Like I said Cheryl's not going to go that far, but uh, we wanted to explore a little bit. Also, if you're not subscribed to the channel, do me a favor. Hit the like button and make sure you're subscribed and you hit the little notify icon. That way you'll find out when I make my next video. And there's at least one video out every week. Yep, she's turning around and headed back now. We just wanted to demonstrate the trail. Now we've moved the vehicle. And Cheryl's backing out of the van again. But this time we're parked down on the beach. It was interesting. The loose sand the Cheryl CI2 doesn't do very well on. And it probably shouldn't even be on the wet sand. But we're going to come down here and we're going to back up a little bit and take a look at the wreck of the Peter Iredale. And you can see it there. This wreck happened in 1908. It was a steel-framed uh, ship. that was a, It was a sailing vessel. It ran aground and just got buried here, and so it makes a good scenic backdrop. A lot of people come out here and visit. Um, at low tide, it, it may be completely out of the water. Here we're seeing that it's up in the, a little bit. The beach is interesting in that it's just really flat, and it goes on, it seems like, forever. Uh, the sand itself, I wouldn't try driving a, you know, a normal vehicle on it. What we did is we went down to where there's a little notch to to come off of the beach and we just kind of powered right on through it. But I think if you were driving in the soft sand, it might be trouble. You look down and your subscribe button is red. That means you're not subscribed. Do me a favor, click on my face. Playlist on the right has other NCL videos I think you'll enjoy. Thanks for watching.